Health experts here in North Texas telling us today we could see Omicron variant infections in the DFW area within the next month. And the plan to fight it is the same weapon used all year, vaccinations. Our Steve Pickett live at the drive through vaccination hub at Dallas College Eastfield with more. Steve? It's been a quiet day here and something, frankly, that public health folks do not want to see. They want to see, they want to see more cars in these lines. We were told, as you mentioned, Brooke, that this new variant is the one reason we are told by experts to get more people in these lines. And if, frankly, if you've been in line, to get in line again. For several getting shots here today, they were getting their third shot, their booster shot. I get COVID like a year ago and I do not uh, want anybody to, to have it. Luis Villalba from Garland. Well, yeah, I want to be around when she got, starts to walk. And 83-year-old great-grandmother Arnolia Nash joining the quiet convoy of cars today with occupants receiving COVID vaccines. Public health advisors throughout North Texas continue to urge families to access neighborhood pharmacies or community clinics now in the effort to protect against the current Delta variant or the now known Omicron variant. We don't know yet, is it gonna be uh, more infectious? Uh, for those that uh, get infected, is it gonna be more severe? Steve Miff leads Parkland Center for Clinical Innovation, researching and documenting COVID spread in and around Dallas County. Infections for Dallas have plateaued, he says, but the fight against infection surge with Omicron or Delta variants have one answer at this point, the vaccination and booster shot rate must increase here. We do know that folks can protect themselves by getting vaccinated now. Uh, and it's up to everybody to just elevate your level where you are today. Elevating those numbers, that's the focal point now with these particular hubs. And again, in your neighborhood clinics, they want to simply get more people there. Give you an example, folks, about 15,000 people per week in Dallas County are getting vaccines back in March. It was 100,000 people a week getting vaccines. Reporting live, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News. Steve, thank you so much for that update.